hi welcome again uh, in this lecture we will uh, display the customers over here in this area we will create a page called view underscore customers so very simply just create a new page and we will simply uh, you know copy this view products code and we will modify it here so I have pasted it here to list to save we will save it with the name view customers dot php that's it we will simply modify it what we need to do simply is to change serial number and name of the customer and uh, email of the customer view all customers and uh, email and that's it Control is to save. Now we will simply say select all from customers. Get C. Get underscore C. That is the name for this query. Run C. Get C. While row C. Run C. And we will take data uh, from first will be CID which will be row C equal to rec row C and customer ID customer underscore ID from the table second will be C underscore name which is from row C array and we will say customer underscore name that's it and after that c underscore email row c and name will be customer underscore email and if you want to also add the picture then we can but we can check first of all check out the customer table we don't have any customer registered right now so we can simply okay that's okay we'll look later to that control is to save now come here and in here simply echo I mean the C underscore name and we can also take the picture C underscore image is equal to row C and then customer underscore image that's it that is saved there and now we will simply say customer images is the folder and here we will echo echo customer under C underscore image and height is ok and after that we will we'll put this one we'll cut this from here and put it here we'll echo c underscore email that's it that's done now uh, the we don't need to edit this uh, person or this customer we will simply delete it if we want to delete we have a code CID and delete underscore C and there will be a page delete C dot PHP to less to save now if we come here and refresh the page and click this view customers so we will see nothing because we have not actually included this page into the to that page I mean I need to actually remove some links we have not put this into the index.php page and just once again copy this fs set block and i have pasted again i will say if view underscore customers variable is active url variable then simply include this view underscore customers page customer.php that's it now refresh this page you will see this view all customers 
<coughs> serial number name and email edit and delete link we don't need edit so we'll remove that edit from here here is the th for that we'll just remove that control s to save now refresh and you can see serial number name email and delete and we can also uh, say instead of uh, edit we can add th and we can say image we'll show image there control s to save refresh again now can show the image so basically we need to actually uh, register another person over here uh, we'll say login register new I will say uh, Abdul Wali its name is Abdul Wali AW Parishan is email address and password will be Wali I will add an, an image as well the image and uh, country will be Afghanistan city will be Kabul and contact number and some kind of address will be here in mean this one create an account okay account has been created okay that's okay it has taken me to the payment page but I want to go to my my account you can see this these are the details now it this detail uh, this customer must be here inside this uh, view customers page just refresh it and you can see abdulwali aw operation at gmail.com and the image is not appearing because we must have some mistake over here customer images echo that is that Uh, we'll just change the width and height to 50 and uh, we need to check out the folder actually oh sorry that image is uh, inside the customer folder customer backslash then after that inside the customer folder there is another folder customer underscore images inside that the picture is existing now refresh and once again there is no picture so we need to actually uh, add double dots and backslash it is out of directory refresh it and you can see the images here so that's it if another user is registered uh, I mean any other customer so that will also be here and this is repeating because we are running a while loop over here and for deleting the customer we can simply do something like uh, you know we can create a, another page and can copy this delete brand code and we can simply put it here and can save it using control s delete underscore c dot php because we have given this name there and we'll simply say if delete c is active then get delete id from this URL variable and delete C is a new variable delete from customers where customer ID is equal to where customer ID is equal to delete ID run delete MySQL delete C and if run delete then say customer has been deleted and redirect the person to view underscore customers page control s to save now come here refresh if you click this you will say a customer has been deleted and there is no customer so it is it has gone the customer has gone now and uh, you can we create one more person I mean Saima Saima at yahoo.com the email Wali is password and if you we add this picture 
and country is Pakistan city Karachi address uh, phone number is anything this is the address and create an account ok account has been created he has been taken to this payment page but will go to my account so this is the new account for this person now we can just replace this page and we will see another user over here so if we add one more user that can also be here basically but we don't want to add more users because we are after this admin panel we are going to integrate the paypal payment gateway and we have a single ip right now so we have done the customers viewing customer part now there is no need for this just uh, simply close this all buttons and uh, in next video we will come back and work or this index page inside I mean now uh, orders are remaining in pay view payments view orders in view payments and that is only possible we will have a paypal button if someone orders the product or buys the product but we will work uh, from next video we will work on the login uh, system for this whole admin panel because without uh, if someone has a password or email they can access this admin panel and can work over here so we will work for login system and after that for logout system stay tuned